Hello guys and welcome back to Let's Play Skyrim! Oh, we're having a wonderful time here in Skyrim. Oh, crap. Press the wrong button. Oh, no! I quick saved. Oh, man. So you're the new recruit, huh? Yeah. Well, looks like you and I are going to have to get very... Right, how much of a... Do I have a bounty on my head? Crime. Lifetown bounty, largest bounty, no bounty. Okay. I'm not going to sugarcoat it for you. What did you that say? We would have to get what? What were you saying to me? So you're the new recruit, huh? Yeah. Well, looks like you and I are going to have to get very well acquainted. Why is that, sir? Oh, lady. I'm the fence down here. You come by anything you don't exactly own, and I'll pay you some coin for it. Minus a little slice for the guild, of course. I can also provide a few supplies useful to our trade now and again. Oh, yes, lockpicks. Lockpicks. Sure. How about I get Dirge to knock you over your head and dump you into the cistern? <laughs> Look, I've been in this business a long time, and I've seen all types. Right. You can play it tough, or you can play it smart. Whatever. At the end of the day, you'll find that all we care about down here is how much gold you can make us. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, that's fine. Then there isn't much more to say. Okay. Here's your armor. Just make sure you put it to good use. I didn't mean any offense, lovely lady. I didn't mean any offense whatsoever. Right. Well... I give special rates to members of the Thieves' Guild. Show me what you've got. Yeah, let's see what I've got. Actually, I don't really know. What have you got for me, though, but out of interest? An orcish bow, orcish dagger, too. Hey, that looks good. Orcish war axe, and like lots of orcish stuff. Daggers, right. Apparel, right. A belt tunic, I don't really care about that. Potion, don't really care about that. Miscellaneous, I want all of your lockpicks. Yes. Right, and uh, what of my stuff can you... do you want to, to buy? What sort of price will you give me for these magic robes? No one's given me a good price for these things. Sell that gold necklace. This armor is 33. Oh man, it doesn't even compare. Right. And keep that on. Right, I'll sell these robes because there's just no point in us carrying them around. I'm going to sell these boots, braces, helmet. Sell that hood and sell these robes. Sell that ring. I'm going to keep that armor though, but I'm going to... Oh yeah, picks are 10% better, lock picking is 15% better, lock picking is 15% more successful, carrying capacity is 20 points. Brilliant. Portions. Uh, all right. Everything else, I don't particularly bother. I'm not particularly right. bothered. Right. Let's put some clothes on <laughs> before people get offended. Right. Let's equip that. Equip that. Equip that. And equip that. Should we see what he looks like now? Oh, it's Hexem the thief. Absolutely awesome. No. Put that away. I can't really get a good view of him. There. Oh, this... Look how awesome he looks. Hexem the Thief. All eyes are on you, lad. Don't disappoint us. Aye. Right. I'm not going to sugarcoat it for you. Right, lovely Vex. So, uh, any idea why? Old Delvin thinks it's some kind of curse. I think he's crazy. Yeah. In my opinion? What's that? It's plain old bad luck. So what can we do? We can get out there and start making a name for us again. Make them start fearing us like they did long ago. And while you're at it, make a little bit of coin on the side. Not a bad deal, eh? Not a bad deal at all. Um... I tell you what, tell me about this golden yeah, glow. Did. That wood elf's wit. He's a lot smarter than I expected. Can you believe that Fetcher had more than tripled the guard? There must no. be eight of them in there. It was like he was daring us to come and get him. Any tips then? Well, 
There's an old sewer tunnel that dumps into the lake on the northwest side of the island. Right. That's how I slipped in there. Should still be unguarded. All right. What? Hm. So yeah, I did. That wood elf's wit. Okay, it's right. That's enough. Than I expected. Let's let's get going then. Actually, I think we should start getting on now with this whole burning down the beehives idea. <laughs> burning down the beehives. Brilliant. Nothing, sir. Excuse me, if you don't mind. I've got a little job that I need to take care of, so I'm going to take care of it. Lydia, are we meant to get up this way or not? Is there a lever or something? Yes. Ah, smart. Come on, Lydia. Thieves Guild discovered. Brilliant. Right. So let's get on with going to this place. Right, where about on the map is it? Oh, they're down here, I see, right. So we need to leave Riften then. This is very exciting. Hello there, guard. Just going for a midnight stroll. Don't mind me. Actually, just checking out the map. All oh, right, we can just skip straight to the Thieves' Guild. It's quite something. Nord belief holds that the honored dead live forever in Sovngarde. These cutscenes, they're quite interesting. I like the way that they use 3D models from the actual game as well. Malakath is the the Daedric Prince of Curses and Spurned. And the Spurned. Many Orc worship him as their God King. We've already discovered this, haven't we? Right. It's... Well, I'm... Hang on a minute. This is a dead spider. Right. Oh, look at that Nordic boat. It's so incredible. It's beautiful. Right. We need to burn down some beehives, and when everybody's distracted, I presume clear out the vault, which means steal all their monies. We've got lots of lock picks, which is I think about forty eight if I am not mistaken. Right. Right, let's just keep sneak down here, lovely Lydia. Okay, you keep sneaking. Do you know what I need from you, actually, Lydia? Lydia, can I speak to you? Swimming in the water. How lovely. What do you need? Yes, wait there. Come out on the land then. Still need me to do something? I've got your back. Can you wait here, please? As you wish, my fame. Right. Wonderful. Right. Well, come back and collect Lydia. You just stay down there, my lovely. While I take care of some beehives. Right. Huh? 
Ah, oh, crap. Hello, sir. <gasps> This is not good. This is bad. I failed. I'll make you pay. Oh, crap. Why do I screw up so badly? Uh. This ends now. Uh, can we just have a little chat? Can we not just end this? I don't really want to fight you. I mean, obviously, you guys don't want to have a fight, do you? Friends, friends, please, friends. Come now. Let's not be like this. This ends now. Ah dear. Right, when was the la where's the last place we can load from? Here, I believe. <laughs> What a pain. Oh, what a pest. Great beards of High Hrothgar follow the teaching of Jürgen Winkolder, who believed the power of the voice was meant f or was was a means, in fact, of enlightenment. Any map locations that have been discovered can be visited unvisited can be fast travelled to from any area outdoors. basically means you can't fast travel out of a dungeon. Although they later became the dedicated protectors of the Emperor, uh, Emperor of Tamriel, the Blades began their existence as renowned dragon slayers. Really? That's very interesting. I didn't actually know that. The Lover Stone ability lets you learn all skills a little faster, but not as much as the Thief, Warrior, or Major Stone. Hmm. What? Doesn't seem to make sense to me. Right. Come on. I'm going to at least get to that island. Oh, actually, Lydia. Lydia. If you don't mind, could you just Still hang about... Here. Hang about here, As please. Wish, my thing. No problem. Thank you. I'll be back, okay? Don't worry. Bye-bye, Lydia. If I need to do this on my own, this is a stealth mission. And I can't quite have the lovely Lydia running around um, because she's very protective and um, I can just imagine that she'd cause some trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Merry Fair. Wonderful. There's a mill. Just out of interest. Um, loud and clear. So I'll enter the... using the sewer. Yes, I want to do that. But I don't know where the sewer is. This is very exciting. Hopefully I won't get spied out here. It's just a wolf. Mr. Wolf! You are annoying. Where are you? What are you doing? Why are you doing that? Don't do that, Mr. Wolf. There's been loads of wolves like you, and they've all died a similar death. You were eating a rabbit, I see. Mmm, tasty rabbit. Okay. Okay, guys. Let us be very, very stealthy here. I'd presume that the sewers would be under the water somewhere. That's typically how uh, sewers work. <laughs> right, let's go back under the water again. Oh, 
right, there's the boat. Right, down we go again. I don't know why we were drowning down there. Right, up underneath the bridge. Okay. Need to find the sewer entrance. Oh, crap. Hopefully he did not see us. Don't think so. <laughs> it's very close. I think we'll quick save here. Right. Have we been discovered or not? Oh dear, I feel very nervous about this whole thing. Right. Well, I think this is a convenient place to save, actually. So when we come back, guys, we will do a little bit more of trying to get into here without being spotted. But that'll be for next time. So until then, guys, stay safe, take care of yourself, and goodbye.